All right, I want to talk about a guy that nobody's really talking about. Valentin Moldovsky, if I'm saying his name right. He is the current interim Bellator heavyweight champion. Now, um, that means he's fighting Ryan Bader next for the undisputed title. Um, I don't know much about him. Uh, I saw that he, he fights with Fedor. He's a, a member of his team. Um, he's got Sambo skills, very good Sambo. That means he can wrestle, he can take guys down. He's got good uh, jiu-jitsu skills. I see on his record he has submitted a few guys. He's not much of a finisher, but he's young. He's in his late 20s, so that means he's still learning. He's growing. But uh, like I said, he's got some good grappling. He's got good wrestling. He can obviously submit guys. He's got punching power. You know, he just doesn't knock people out, but that doesn't, that doesn't mean that he can't knock guys out. Obviously, he can. And uh, obviously, we all know Ryan Bader. He fought with the UFC. He went 12-0 at one point before getting beat by John Jones. Um, had some good fights in the UFC. He's um, a multi-time world champion with Bellator. When he was when the when uh, excuse me when he was in the UFC, he was the Ultimate Fighter winner a long time ago. Um, in terms of experience, I got to give it to Ryan Bader because of his knockout power. He's also a good wrestler. I think he wrestled with Arizona State along with Cain Velasquez years and years ago. So it's very hard to pick a winner in this fight. But if I had to pick a winner, I'm gonna give it to Valentine. Or Valentin, you know, I think he's gonna win this fight. He's gonna find a way to out grapple Ryan Bader. He's gonna avoid the big right hand, the big punching power that Ryan Bader put Fedor out with. And you know that fight's got to be in the back of Valentine's head, just because he trains with him. He sees Fedor as a mentor, probably, and he might have a little bit of bad blood in terms of him beating his mentor. So now he needs to get revenge his mentor's loss. Um, so. That's an interesting fight. I'm going to give the edge to Valentine. I think he wins a unanimous decision. Like I said, he's going to outgrapple Ryan Bader. Uh, I think he's going to do enough on the feet to get by. And I think the grappling, he's going to get some takedowns in this fight. He's going to stop a few takedowns from Ryan Bader. Ryan might get one takedown, but he's going to get outclassed in this fight. And again, Valentine is young. He's not even hitting his peak yet as a fighter. He's only been fighting since 2014. So I think he easily wins this fight by unanimous decision. 49, 46, 50, 45, 49, 46, and new.